What is up, guys? It's Superken for Superken Gaming. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you comment saying hi, thumbs up. If you like the video already, share this video with your friends and welcome to First Impressions, where I bring the first 10 minutes of a game, present them to you. And this week, we're playing The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Blood and Wine. And we are tasked with going to a contract notice board. And we're here. Why aren't you opening board? All right. Let's take all of them. Meet the knight. Meet the knights from Tassant and Holloway. Let's just fast travel there. All that gold and those jeans. You have you have the choice of either loading a previous save or they will create a Geralt for you. I think you have to be level 34. The recommended level is 34. Or maybe it's 35 or something. My Geralt is level 38, so I'm fine for this DLC. So I just use mine. So my cash carried over, all my gear carried over, everything. Plus, there's a lot of a lot of new upgrades, I've noticed, in the menus. Hello, knights. What are you all going on about? I've not got no need for your help. Have no fear, good man. Our labors shall be done quickly. The prowlers to be banished for good. Milton, look. It's Geralt of Rivia. Get out. In the flesh. Hail, With Witcher. My fancy gear. Let us go inside and greet you as befits an old friend. And you, fear not. Look at their fancy gear, though. To the rule of outlaws soon. Gets to tell me about vampires and such. On a notice board. You see, Palmerin, I told you, the Griffin at White Orchard. I knew that were we only to follow the tracks of its slayer, we would in the end find Geralt. Milton well, de Payrak Payrin and Palmerin de Lanfor. Good to see you both. In years. We are short. We share your joy. You must forgive us our uh, surroundings. When we pledged to place the village under our protection. The village elder gave us this hut as our lodgings. He saw it is the best hut in the village. Get involved in some squabble? We discovered that in retreating, the Redanian garrison that left this land still has set the mercy of numerous plagues. A tyranny of bandits, the most onerous among them. These plunderers shall soon descend on this village to collect tribute. Milton and I will dissuade them. We are both sworn to fight injustice and oppression wherever they rear their heads. The matter does not concern you, of course, but do us the kindness of waiting. Once we have dealt with these marauders, we have a matter we must present to you. Let me help you with the bandits. So, plan to go out and meet the bandits when they arrive? Fight them? Parmaron wishes first to appeal to their sense of decency. Decency and bandits? I expect they will be deaf to this. Yeah, completely. We must afford them a chance to stand down. Many a hardened outlaw has left the path of wrongdoing upon hearing words of admonition. Doesn't happen in these lands. Ever. If they do not heed my reprimand, we at least will know we have done all within our means to evade bloodshed. Fine. Naturally, I'll help when Palmerin's rhetoric falls on deaf ears. Excellent. Then we've but to wait for the rogues to arrive. Let's get this. Let's get this r show on the road, as Thomas Jefferson once said. I think. Days are coming. Hear that? Your bandits have arrived. Let us go out to greet them. With our swords. That, that cat look at itself. Why? Why the shot of the cat? Okay. Cats don't like horses, clearly. What is this? 
Hark! Contemptible cars! Sorry, Bannons, but <laughs> Super Ken's here. Us? I, Palmerin de Lonfall, call upon you to repent. Search your hearts. Do you not see that they are blackened? <laughs> Regular punch and duty here. To prey upon commoners is no honor. To loot their meager stores, abandon the path of shame, and we will spare you. <laughs> really? Right, good jest. That was the last straw that. if you catch my drift. Now, fuck off or we lose our patience and you lose something else. I've already lost my hey, patience. Wait, Zorg. These lads are a lark. Mayhaps they know some tricks. Oi, players! Can you toss balls all loopity like? Or, or do that thing where one spits fire while the other farts? <laughs> Seems they won't heed your call. Seems to me they're unmoved. You try it, my friend. Let's do this. Let's slay some fools. We've talked enough. I forget how I forget how to play this game, but let's do it. I haven't played since what? August last year? When did uh the blue one come out? Hearts of Stone. These level 35 bandits. Well, they're no map for Gero or Rivia. I got the sword of the champion. I forget how to block. Is blocking even possible in this game? Appearing. For Toussaint, indeed. Fellow. Comrade. Oh! -ho! He got sliced. Geralt got your tongue and everything else. Why do they not emerge? It is over. We have fancy, the a fancy shining Lift sword. The yoke from their lives. Warned you it'd be like this. Fear you as much as they did the bandits now. Sorry, no fanfares and flowers. You're not in Toussaint. Ugh, it is true what folk claim. In the north, no noble deed goes unthwarted. It is time to go home. And we shall, my friend. <laughs> Those legs. The the fact that I just left his legs gets me. Let's go deliver our message of our victory and our triumph over these fools that dare get in the path of Super Ken of Rivia with Geralt. So fess up. What brings you such a long way? We are to deliver Her Grace the Duchess's message in full, with all due ceremony. For tradition is sacred in Toussaint. All right, fine. Most honorable Geralt, slayer of monsters and all Ifils nefarious, which prey on the defenseless of this world. For us never have you been known to deny help to the innocent, nor leave widows and orphans to fates undeserved. Answer you now our present summons. Free us from the beast which floods our streets with blood, and oh, sows well. panic in the hearts of rich and poor alike. Come to our aid, witcher. Thus I'll humbly beseeches read. you the star Cross city's most gracious protectress, her illustrious highness, Duchess Anna Henrietta. She sounds hot. Shall you answer her call? Uh, yeah. This beast, tell me more. Might be the most fervent request that I take a contract ever, and the most polite. And now we've got all that behind us. I want to hear more about this beast. Some kind of monster? Just guessing. Most assuredly, though no one has caught a good look at it as yet, our only sure witnesses, bodies massacred in a brutal, horrid manner. Look, some sketches drafted from descriptions given by those who claim they glimpsed the beast. Each quite different. 
To my mind, these witnesses lie. How many victims so far? Two. When her grace learnt of the second, she discharged us immediately to fetch you, promising grants of land and fortunes in gold, should you answer her summons. Fortunes of gold? Wind blows, Promise some fortunes and booties. Cannot be tracked. Folks say it wields black magic. Also, both victims were nobly born, and the start of a tourney draws near. I'll take the contract. Uh, I sometimes think back to all the contracts I've ever taken from sovereigns. Can't name hardly any where I came out ahead. You cannot be thinking to refuse. <sighs> no. Just struck by a thought. How the Duchess can sometimes be... Mm, demanding. So you accept the contract? Of course I Excellent. accept. We must set off at once. We long wanted this land searching for you. Yet time is of the essence. Ready to go. Soon as you're packed. Ah, Tell him been ready. To Tucson. To, Tucson. to Tucson indeed. Looks like you guys aren't going to get to see Tucson. So I'm going to end. First impressions there. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Thumbs up if you like the video. And tune in next week for the backlog part one of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Blood and Wine. Because we're finishing up Uncharted this week. Next week, Blood and Wine week. Gameplay then. Thanks for watching.